Hey, it's Kutsky. Just wanted to touch base quickly, let you know what's going on in my world. I want to say a big shout out to everybody who came out raving last weekend. Absolutely awesome stuff. On Friday, I was in Port Rush, a, a legendary club called Kelly's. They normally have, you know, kind of like the biggest of the biggest acts in the world. You know, kind of like your, your Paul Van Dykes, your Fat Boy Slims, you know, just basically not Scallies like this playing there so I want to say a big shout out to the promoter Col, legendary promoter in Northern Ireland and he had uh, faith to bring me in as one of the first acts to ever play certainly in a very long time to play hard music in that venue and we took a risk on it about five years ago uh, and it's turned out absolutely awesome we get a great turnout every year for that electric atmosphere as always so yeah I just want to say a big shout out to everyone who came out making that night a success as well as everyone who came to Bristol on the Saturday following that as well that was our last gig of the Neon Nation tour that we've been taking around the world at the moment and to be honest it was one of the gigs that I was more nervous at because all the other locations we've done with run parties there before so we kind of knew what to expect I was a little bit nervous about Bristol with it being the last one we had such a big lineup so yeah maximum respect to everybody who came out to that party uh, just reading online afterwards it seems like everyone that was there had a great time and especially all the DJs as well which was nice everyone being entertained as always by Scott Brown backstage I'd posted something on Facebook kind of the day after saying you know it was great to catch up with friends and everything and uh, Scott Scott Brown was on there saying, yeah, thanks guys, great to catch up for everybody, sorry for being me. Scott, never apologise for being you, that's why we love you. Other than that, it's been a busy week. Uh, we've just been having a lot of mither with keeping the rave alive, to be honest. We've moved over all the shows to a new server that we're working on, so that's been up and down. If you've been having any problems uh, during the last week or so with that, you know, maybe uh, some of the shows not showing up, should be all sorted now. We're in the process of building a new website, so that's going to be up online soon. And this week's show is a special one, so make sure you tune into that. Uh, we've got Kane, uh, the hardstyle Viking who's on the show this week. One of the rising talents coming out of the UK scene at the moment, absolutely smashing it. And one of the finest beards you're gonna see anywhere in dance music as well. It's him, it's fucking dancing. Other than that, I worked on a new music video. I say music video in air quotes. It's like the best, worst music video you've ever seen kind of on that low budget comedy tip. I think we filmed, wrote, recorded, edited it all in the space of about five hours. But it's, uh, it's pretty amusing, apart from the fact that we had to record it near where I live and that had to be the day that all of my neighbours were out and I don't want to give too much away about what actually went on in the video but let's just say it involved me wearing a suit, a bald hat and Jordan wearing full camo and a tinfoil hat and of course Jordan being Jordan he wanted to have a conversation with all my neighbours about this as well No one in my neighbourhood is ever going to take me seriously again that one's out at the end of the month. Really looking forward to seeing the feedback on that one. So obviously me and Jordan, different styles of music. So uh, yeah, we met somewhere in the middle on like, kind of that like old school hard trance tip. So I'm hoping uh, people are gonna be feeling that one. It's gonna be out at the end of the month on Damage Records. So I better wrap this up now because I'm just packing at the moment because I'm on an early flight out to Canada tomorrow. I'm playing at True North Festival in Toronto, which I'm looking forward to. There's been a lot of hype for that one online. Uh, then I get to chill in Toronto for a week, which is cool because I've never really got to spend any time in the city before now. And then down to LA to play at Control at Avalon. That's going to be next Friday on the 26th of May. So really excited for that one as well. Busy times as always. So yeah, if I don't see you out raving this weekend, where you have you are raving, make sure you have a good one. Until next time, this is Kutsky signing out. Keep the rave alive.